Okay, last time we were here, you were talking about <laughs> being back in the green room at, at the comedy club and really needing to pee and not mm -hmm. wanting to walk through the club and blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so I brought you the greatest invention ever. Oh, really? For your next gig. Miller Lite bottle or, <laughs> oh, Mike August's mouth? I'm trying to think what I usually use. Wow. Wow. <laughs> that sounds awesome. Wow. That, that sounds awesome. Yeah. I like the idea that he hiccups a little in there. Wow. That, that sounds awesome. <laughs> He's really reaching for it. Okay, so this is... Uh, travel John. The Travel John. Wow. Right? <laughs> for men, women, and children. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yeah, you wow. are. you're turning wow. me on. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> How does this thing work? So basically, it's, it's a little thing. Well, by the way, I took one of them out of the package because I need one in the car just in case there's a traffic jam on the floor. Sure, five. sure. But, you know, so it's this... Portable disposable urinal. You unroll it, uh -huh. you pee into it, oh. and it instantly turns it into an odorless gel. You could pee into it and then turn oh, it upside down. Oh, so I can do my hair up before I go out <laughs> on stage too. Wow! <laughs> wow! So it's wow. it's it's sort of a it's 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 a cross between a sort of a a diaper and a cat box that you kind of hold and in a, front of you and a flashlight. Right. Right. You're right. Yeah, but it, it's. It's handy. Trust wow, me, man. I, I have used them. Really? Wow. Uh -huh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Am I Look, getting paid can I by see the how, wow? Can I see how it's shaped? Yeah, I think you should actually have an intern. Uh, no, uh, oh, I see. Yeah. It. Oh, right. And it's got a, it's got kind of an open mouth size of a eh, five-pound bass <laughs> at the end. Looks like it's smiling well, at your penis a that's, little bit. That's so it's big enough for girls. I see. So you can I just see. like... And I would just sort of drop my dork in there and go to town. Oh, uh -huh. I like that. Right? I wonder, now that I think about it, because last time, I, I, I'm i almost sure, la last time we were heading back from Irvine, um, we're at the Improv, and uh, going to be there tonight, by the way, kiddies, as I mentioned before, but we're heading back, and, you know, I had a couple of Miller Lights up on stage. Maybe we did a couple of shows. It's a good hour, 10, 15-minute ride. Coming home about 12, 12.30 at night, and at some point we hit some traffic, and it's like, I just had to piss. I'm and uh, we pulled over. I don't know why, but the town just outside of your town that you have to stop off and piss at is always the worst town in the fucking city. Stopped off at, like, Hawaiian Gardens or something, like, on the, something off the five, like, scary land. But there is this weird kind of thing where you feel so, almost invincible because you're just pissing so badly or you have to piss so badly. It's almost like there's no way any gangbanger can fuck with you because you're, you're, <laughs> you're it, it's like he can fuck with you like if you're with your girlfriend, you just bought a new watch, you're out on a walk or something. But I'm pissing so badly that I would mow over any crip or blood that came after me. But I also wonder, legally... What would they call this? I mean, I know they could still hit you for, like, indecent exposure or something, but if you opened your car door at night, sort of stood in the crack of it, nothing hit the cement, do you think you could win a, uh, you know, well, see, Johnny I, Law came around? I think you could actually use that while still driving. Oh, really? Wow. Yeah, no, you, I mean, you, you couldn't. I could not. But I could. Though I would try if mm -hmm. it got bad enough. Cruise control, you know. Sure, sure. <laughs> I'd like to watch that. <laughs> Steer yeah. with one knee. I'd like to be under that glass coffee table. <laughs> wow. Yeah. All right. Well, you know, this is this is. I, I I'm sorry. I got. It's just I, I. I'm not used to receiving such generous <laughs> gifts from almost strangers. Wait. No, this is awesome. I'm putting it in my glove box. You know what? I'm going to put it on my boat, my RV, and my race car. Wait. Look at the top of uh, the top of the box. It has all the symbols for where you can use it. And, it, and yeah, it's like right. you can take it on the plane. Airplane, yeah. camping. By the way, camping. <laughs> the only reason I camp is to piss on pine cones. Sure. Like that. The whole. That's the perk of camping it's, is pissing. It's just another demographic they're trying to reach. Yeah. yeah. Now this is. Uh, I'm sorry. I understand. Van. That I can dig. Airplane. Fine. Sailboat. Pup tent, I can dig that. But uh, on to a guy with a wheelchair, I'm not into that. I, I totally disagree with that. I feel like it's way out of line. <laughs> Wait, I love that they have both the handicap sig uh, symbol and then also a bed. Like, wh what is that for? You just don't want to get up? Like, You know what? That bathroom is a good 11 feet from where my <laughs> cock is. And I just don't feel like making the pilgrimage tonight. There you go. I didn't feel like you'd burn more calories in bed trying. I guess this would happen. Like, one, when I, 
I dislocated my shoulder playing football a million years ago, and I was I was when my shoulder was oh, out of pop water. yes in pop Warner football. My my shoulder's out of socket for four days, and two or three of those days I was I was on the sofa at my house, if you want to call it that, and I I was pissing into a mason jar like I couldn't get up. There are those I'm in bed and I ain't going nowhere. That's what this is for. I but had I, the uh, I had the bedside urinal on the worst of my. Uh, my recovery period, about a year ago. Really? Yeah, I did it for a long time, too, because getting up in the middle of the night, you're disoriented anyway. Think about, you know, having the uh, problems that I had on top of that. I sure. Was not, I was a wreck, man. I fell down a couple times before getting that on the uh, the bedside. Really? Yes. Uh, Scary times. All right. Well.